Are you facing difficulty finding baby formula in the market? So this video is for you. Hi, I'm Lovely and this is The Lovely Life. In today's video, I will be giving you a few alternatives for baby formula. And I must tell you, this video is only for those mothers who have children above the age of six months. I mean, the babies, uh, you know, who, who have started on eating uh, semi-solids. So it is not meant for those babies who are just, you know, breastfed or uh, they are under the age of six months. Because in India, uh, that's what even I followed with my daughter. I just fed uh, breast milk. I nursed her for six months, uh, even no water. So these are the things that I did. I never gave a baby formula. Uh, I've been lucky that I could feed her. And when we started on semi-solids, that's um, around the time she was um, almost six months, you know, five and a half, six months. So we started on semi-solids. So I'm going to be sharing all the recipes of things that I used to feed my daughter, uh, you know, after she was six months and until the time she could eat solid food. So the first recipe, the main ingredient here is the whole wheat flour, which we also call atta, which we use to make chapatis or rotis. So all you need to do is take maybe a few spoons of it and dry roast it on a pan until it is uh, you know the color changes a bit to a lighter brown and uh, just add a little water so that it turns into a paste consistency a creamy consistency and you can add a little sugar for taste what you have to be careful is once you add water immediately you need to bring it out of flame don't keep it too long uh, on the flame because it can get thick. What you can also do is if you feel that, uh, you know, the ready mixture is a little bit too uh, thick, you can either add a little more water or milk to it so that it is of the very soft consistency and you can easily feed it to your baby. So this was the first recipe. The second thing that I used to give my daughter was made out of suji. Suji is semolina. You can google it up. It's a very common ingredient. It's a very common thing that we use in Indian kitchen. So the same thing has to be followed. Dry roast a little, you know, few uh, teaspoons of uh, semolina on a, dry, on a pan. You can also add a little bit of clarified uh, butter. That's mm, ghee that we call ghee or a little butter maybe unsalted one if you want to add a little taste to it and if your baby is okay with that. So on that you will be dry roasting uh, semolina or suji and same thing you have to follow you have to add a little water once it is it you know it is a little roasted it has changed its color and immediately switch off the pan switch off the flame. In this you can either add a little salt or sugar whichever your baby likes I used to make it you know just to um, have a little bit of change every day because she'll get too bored of it so sometimes I used to feed her with uh, salt it almost uh, is like upma that we eat you know uh, for Indian breakfast so this is another alternative the third thing that you can do is you can add a little bit of ragi flour that's another kind of millet flour which is very healthy you can mix ragi flour and whole wheat flour and make the same thing trust me guys uh, until my daughter started eating uh, you know solid food like rice or chapati she used to love these things and it's very uh, easy to make it's like minutes um, less than a minute maybe it's it's very easy because the quantity is so less and you can make it fresh every single time so I hope that helps all the mothers who are struggling to find uh, baby formula out in the market and uh, again the reminder that this video is only meant for those mothers who have children above the age of six months so I hope this will be helpful 
I will be coming back with more videos soon. Keep the fear away and stay safe. Bye-bye.